To start off with, uh, I had a bit of an open mind to it. I, you know, it's difficult with some things to measure the uh, practical results out of them. But I reckon equisage is one of the things that we can uh, absolutely measure. You know, I know from the feedback from riders, uh, when we use equisage in the morning, we put them on and uh, we get a freer trot straight away. So it's definitely of benefit. I think that uh, when you're increasing the blood flow and the circulation of horses in a general sense, um, that it's got to be of benefit, you know. Uh, according to my riders, the ones we use it on are the ones that they get the most benefit out of, you know. Uh, so all I can say is, you know, I go on results. Uh, we've got no sort of uh, witchcraft involved in here, you know. We put it on, the horses seem freer, and, uh, you know, I'm a believer. I've, you know, we've bought a couple and uh, we're uh, pretty solid on them and uh, you know I'll continue to use them. Look we use it in conjunction obviously you get a lot of soft tissue injuries in the stable you know we're working 75 athletes here every morning and uh, we've got a very very good chiropractor Mike Bryant you know he's done all the top horses uh, in Australia for a long time uh, he will give us a sheet of what we what he thinks we need to treat now some are ultrasound some are equisage but I just find uh, depending on what Mike Bryant says we use the equisage uh, you know we might use a bit of ultrasound but uh, certainly it's one of the tools we use and I think it's of great benefit you know especially you know uh, horses over the back in particular horses over the uh, in, in particular the lumbar part of the spine and the muscles around there uh, we just find equisage gives us a really, a really sort of a quicker fix on it. You know, uh, we don't have to stop our horse for too long. You know, we're never putting them out when we get Mike Bryant's report. We can do it in the stable, and I just think the turnaround time on it's a lot better. And uh, I just think it's one of our necessary tools now. Look, uh, Caroline's probably even more fussy than me, <laughs> and. Uh, I know, you know, some of those show jumpers, they get a bit, quite a bit of age on them. Um, you know, our horses might get to five or six and seven and eight maybe, but uh, some of the show jumpers she's had, and she's a rider who can feel the difference in particular, and uh, she doesn't, she, on those older show jumpers, she doesn't ride them now without putting the equisage on them first, and she says as soon as they get on the arena, they're a lot freer, and she doesn't have to, uh, I think it's better for the horse, so, um, you know, based on what she says, uh, you know, we've got one at home, we've got them everywhere now. That's this horse called Lankan Rupee. Uh, he obviously uses it, we use it on the, in the mornings on him. Uh, it's quite a heavily muscled horse, we haven't had a lot of issues with him, but the thing about um, increased circulation and blood flow to horses, it's more a prevention. You know, we don't want to be fixing things up after the event. So on horses like him, uh, we put him on for 10 minutes in the morning, 10 to 15 minutes, he stands there, he relaxes with it, uh, he's used to it, and I think it's an enormous benefit for him. Contact us today for a free demonstration.